Hey, MS Delta. Welcome to this week's In the Zone Report. I'm your host, Pamela Wood, joined by my co-host, the lovely Melanie Holden. Melanie, please say hello. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Melanie, give us the update on the numbers. My pleasure. Here we are. We're now in week 11. Just a reminder, in week 10, we were at $450,000. And everyone, look at that. We have passed the half million mark. Yay. We are so excited. We are, are getting so much closer to our zone goal of $1.4 million, which we will hit before January 15th. Now, let's look at our leaderboard. Last week, just a reminder, we had Mississippi, followed by Louisiana, Arkansas, and Tennessee. Had a little bit of a switch. We have, of course, Mississippi still out front, guys, but there's been a switch for second place. Arkansas is now in second place, followed by Louisiana and Tennessee. Everyone's doing a great job in helping move us closer and closer to our goal. Got to break it down by agencies, of course. VA is still leading the way. Keep it up, VA. Um, and you see our IRS and our other agencies. We do want to give a shout out to our Dennis Space Center, who has just made so many leaps and bounds, uh, as well as, you know, our, our other agencies. So we're proud of you all. Keep it up. And who's going to be on the leaderboard next week? We don't know. But you are out there working hard. And we know that you're busy. You say you're going to get to it when you get around to it. Or you're going to do it when you get... Why do I always, like, you know what it is. You know this saying. You're going to... Do it Do when it. you get a round to it. So it. Boom, here it is. Your weekly round to it is here. We also like to make sure that we give you some action items to keep you on track. And so here's, here are some of the action items that we said this week. And we want to give a shout out because there are some agencies who are taking us up on it and are really getting around to it. So Pamela, who is on the top of our shout out list for this week? I am so excited to shout out Nathan Fedor. Nathan is at the VA Health Systems here in New Orleans, and he actually met up with me on Friday to get some more charity booklets. He'd run out. He needed more. We exchanged the information, but here's the interesting thing. On Sunday, I went to an outdoor Saints game viewing six people out in the lawn, yeah. you know, safe, safe distancing, watching the game. Long story short, the person next to me said they worked for the VA and my antenna went up and I said, oh, you work for the VA. Have you heard about the CFC? And he said, in turn, I have. Yeah. Not only have I heard about it, we love the CFC. He went on to say, I get emails almost daily about what's happening in the CFC campaign. He said, it's nonstop. And I was like, that's my Nathan. Okay, that's my Nathan, taking the information that we are sending to him and dispensing it out to his entire agency. And that's what you need to do. So shout out to Nathan for the plug from someone in his system, in his agency, that didn't know how they were getting the information, but they knew that they were getting it. Shout out, Nathan. That's what's up, Nathan. We see why VA is leading the way. Great job. Who else do we have? Matt Labar, the awesome Matt Labar. He had won at the giveaway at the launch party some, you know, fabulous little items that I sent to him. He got them in the mail and wrote me a one-line email that said, Pamela, I wore my CFC show some love button at work on Friday. That's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Spread the love continually, if not subliminally, to the folks in your agency. Way to go, Matt. Yeah, that's it, Matt. Keep it up. We also want to give a shout out to our Postal team in Mississippi led by Angela Atkins. Angela, we see you. We know that you're always at our virtual events and we appreciate that. We love you and we are so excited about what the Mississippi postal team is going to be doing for showing some love to our charities. We also want to shout out our Louisiana postal team. Tell us about what they've been doing. Yes, I got a call from Renette last week mm -hmm. saying, you know what, they need to really kick off their stuff at the U U.S. Postal System down here in Louisiana. They're ready to go. And she just wanted a few hints on how to really pump it up. So we've, we've got a little plan coming for you, Postal System out there at, in Louisiana. Keep your eyes and ears open. Shout out to you, Renette, for trying to do the best you can. To all our postal workers, we thank you all. 
And we want to give a shout out as well to our veteran affairs teams across the zone. You guys, again, are leading the way and rocking and rolling. Unfortunately, it, there's too many of you all to announce in our in the zone, but we're thinking about you. And look, we are cheering you guys on. Keep it up. Keep it up. We have a special shout out that we want to give right now to you because you see Pamela, you see me, you see our faces all the time. But one face that you don't see, but she is so important on our team, is Paige Farmer. We want to give a special shout out to Paige. Paige, we thank you so much for everything that you do. She is uh, so wonderful at putting together our weekly newsletters. She helps coordinate the Lunch and Learns. And so, so, so many things. And we couldn't do what we do helping you without her helping us. So Paige, thank you. You get a round of applause. And we just want to let you know, we so appreciate you. Absolutely. All of you, all of you campaign champions out there, we thank you. Keep on spreading the word about the CFC so that we can um, raise as much money as we can for our charities and let us know what you're doing so we can give you a shout out in next week's In the Zone report. Speaking of our zone, we are such a busy zone. What's coming up, Pamela? Well, guess what? There is a fun run coming up. It is the last kickoff event of the year. Yes. So start getting your teams together. December 18th through January the 1st, there will be more details coming mm -hmm. soon. Tuesdays, as always, there's campaign news, but this coming Tuesday, there will be a special military CFC huddle. We want to pump you guys up in the military, December 22nd, 1 p.m. There's also our after hour huddle at 2 p.m. If you've got questions about how to move your campaign, how you thank your people, it's coming around to that time already. And on Wednesdays, today, today only, there's a charity fair at 1 p.m. And guess what? We've got some superstars coming through. The Alzheimer's Research and Prevention Foundation, America's Warrior Partnership, Build a School Foundation, Catholic Charities Archdiocese of New Orleans, Friends of Children's Hospital, and oh my gosh, to top it off, the National Civil Rights Museum out of Memphis, Tennessee. <laughs> I mean, yes. we, we're bringing you the stars of charities. Yes. Don't sleep on us, okay? And finally and lastly, we're always in the zone report, right? We're yes. always doing it here on Wednesday. That's right. And Pamela and I are hosting that charity fair. So you better come support us as we support you and supporting our charities. So we'll see you this afternoon. And as always, we are going to be here for you. So call us, email us so that we can continue to assist you and support you and are cheering you on. You see Pamela sparkly do. <laughs> and whatever you do, continue to keep spreading the word. And again, together, we're going to reach our zone goal of 1.4 million before January 15th. We'll see you next week in the zone. Bye, everyone. Bye, everybody.